Hey guys, Jessica here, Furry Family Coach, and I wanted to jump on here today to give you some more holiday tips. Um, for people out there, so many of us have dogs and or cats, and so I wanted to talk about Christmas trees. As you can see behind me, I have a fake Christmas tree, but so many of us have real Christmas trees. They're wonderful, they smell amazing. I totally understand the draw. Um, but I did want to just get this information out there for those of you who may not know, um, just to be safe with your dogs and your cats. Don't let them drink the water that um, is in the uh, tree holder um, that is, can have all kinds of bacteria and sap and things in it that can make your cat or dog sick. So don't let them drink that water, though you do need to make sure you replenish it to keep your tree alive. Um, also, pine needles are a really difficult thing um, because, I, you know, when you pick them up, they're so hard and they're pointy. They can hurt your fingers if you touch the ends of them, um, especially as they start to dry out. And if your cat or dog ingests a pine needle, it can puncture their, uh, the wall of their intestines. So those are super dangerous. So don't let your dog or cat ingest a pine needle. Um, so make sure to keep all of that clean, that area around your tree clean. You know, that when, when I had a real tree, I would vacuum every single day um, right around the tree just to make sure I had all those pine needles cleaned up uh, so they were never just sitting there. And um, yeah, so if you have a fake tree like I do, you also do want to be careful. Just make sure that your dog or cat is not chewing on the tree. Um, with all the lights that we put on the tree, make sure that your dog or cat isn't chewing on the wires, the electrical wires. They can get shocked, um, and that's never good. So, you know, just a few extra tips around the holidays. Some of you may have thought about them. Some of you may have not thought about them. So go ahead and share this information with your family and friends just to make sure everyone, including our dogs and cats, has a happy and safe holiday. And I will, oh, if you haven't joined the Train Positive group, go ahead and do so. I can put a link in the description. And yeah, so it's getting closer and closer to um, our holiday, um, Christmas. And so yeah, just have a happy holidays, guys. And let's make sure we're taking care of those dogs and cats while we do it. So I'll see you guys in the next video.